Well, let's see about selection. When you have an object in object mode, uh, in local axis, you can move in the direction. But on more complex uh, mesh, or if you freeze, you lose uh, the local axis on the direction you want. Of course, you can switch to component mode, select a face, and now you will get back. But this is temporary. This is not uh, the true local pivot. If you go back to object mode, you see the true local pivot is now back here. It's the difference with this tool. You just select the face, you click, and now you have the object mode, which is uh, baked. Okay, you can see you are well on object mode. Well, the second one is a bit like the old school double click on perimeter edge tool from Maya. You know before on all version of uh, Maya, when you double click, that's not select all perimeter border, but only uh, a continuous edges. Now, if I want to select this, I have to select the first one, the second one, and click. For that, you have this tool that will select naturally the continuous edge only on the border and until a strong angle uh, changement. So you just have to select one edge, you click, and it will select the continuous edge naturally, automatically for you. Now, the fill selection tool works on face mode and as is name that will fill a uh, selection. Here, for example, I can use tab for recast selection. Okay, be sure you have a close one. And if I want all the face inside, in Maya, it's pretty compli complicated. You have to, to deal with a different type of selection. Now, you just select this one and you will have a pre-selection mode if you want the outside or outside or the inside, of course, and I click. Okay, so this is the first method. The first one, as you can see, will only select inside, but not keep the outside selection. And the second one will add to the outside selection. Pretty powerful, like uh, in C4D software, there is a selection like that. I use it uh, all the time. Uh, this one is for the select every X edge, so rocks on edge mode, of course. You click and that will select every X edges. Uh, you have option here to every third, every two, etc. Every two and on the ring that rocks on the ring mode also. The last one is a kind of debugger. For example, I want to have to check the end gun on this selection that will select the end gun. Same thing for triangle, and you can check. It's a kind of a face checker.